Factsverse presents Rude Hand Gestures from Around the World Number 1. The South Paw Handshake, Malaysia In all parts of the world, people shake hands with their right hand. It's just the way it's done. In some parts of the world, like Malaysia, shaking hands with the left hand is considered an insult. In these areas of the world, if you want to shake the hand of someone you don't like, use your left hand. It's a serious insult. Number 2. Mina Frega, Italy In English, the Italian phrase non mi frega translates to I don't give a damn. Well, there's also a gesture that goes along with the saying. When a person sweeps their hand under their chin toward the other person, it's a silent way of saying that you could care less. It's also very blunt. Number 3. You suck cock. Global. When a person holds a fist to their mouth and then shake it toward the other person, it's a very blunt way of telling them that they suck. To add insult to injury, an even worse word is added afterwards. In all parts of the world, this hand gesture is extremely insulting. Number 4. The Wanker, Britain. If a British person comes up to you with a fist and they move it up and down, don't think that they want to be your friend. They're actually calling you a wanker, which is a major insult in Britain. If a British person does this when they see you, it's best to just walk away. Their reason for approaching you probably isn't a friendly one. Number 5. Thumbs Up – West Africa, Greece, and Iran In the United States, a thumbs up is a gesture that you give somebody when they did a good job. In Iran, Greece, and West Africa, it is the exact opposite of that. In these parts of the world, the person is telling you that their thumb is cold and that your bum would be a great place to warm it up. It's crazy how some rude hand gestures from around the world are actually positive hand gestures in other parts of the world. Number 6. The V Sign – Ireland, New Zealand, South Africa, Australia, and the United Kingdom In many places around the world, when someone makes a V with their hands, it means victory. Many teammates will look at each other and give each other the V sign. In other places around the world, a V doesn't mean victory. It's actually a declaration of war. If you're in Ireland, New Zealand, South Africa, Australia, or the United Kingdom, you should avoid using the V hand gesture unless you are ready for a fight. Number 7. The Dog Call – The Philippines and Most Asian Countries in the United States and in various parts of the world, pointing your finger at yourself and extending it up and down means that you want that person to come to you. If you're in the Philippines and in most other Asian countries, you don't want to use this hand gesture. If you do, you could find yourself in a lot of trouble. In some cases, you could wind up in jail. Number 8. The AOK -okay. – France, Belgium, Tunisia, Turkey, the Middle East, Greece, Brazil, Germany, and South America. In the United States, when a person holds their hand out and they connect their index finger and their thumb, it's the A-OK -okay sign. It means a person that you're doing it to has done a great job. If you are in certain parts of the world, though, you do not want to use this gesture. In many parts of the world, this gesture can mean anything from calling someone gay, calling them a butthole, telling them to F themselves. Before you use this gesture, you should probably think about where you are. Number 9. The Corna, Italy and Spain. In the United States, when a person holds up their pinky finger and their index finger, it means rock on. In Spain and Italy, it means something completely different. This hand gesture is a way of telling somebody that you're sleeping with their wife. If you're visiting Italy or Spain, you want to avoid using this hand gesture. Unless, of course, you actually are sleeping with their wife, and then please stop. That's just wrong. Number 10. The Tapita, Chile. If you're in Chile and you make a fist with a small hole and put your other hand in front of it, it's a sign that you're telling a person they have a small penis. Number 11. The Fig Sign – China and India If you're in China or India and you make a fist but you put your thumb between your index fingers and your middle finger, it's a huge insult. It either represents the female genitalia, which is pretty rude, or it's a rude way of dismissing a person's request. Number 12. The Vulcan Salute 
This hand gesture is rather silly. If you create a V using your index finger and middle finger together and your ring finger and pinky finger together, you're making the Vulcan salute. And there's nothing wrong with making this hand gesture unless you're surrounded by Klingons, which probably is not going to happen. Number 13. Bared Souls – Countries in the Middle East in many cultures, if you point your bare foot at someone, it's considered an insult. Number 14. The Little Finger Wag – The United States and the United Kingdom In the US and the UK, if you go up to a man and show him your pinky finger, you're telling him that you think he has a small penis. How rude! Number 15. The Middle Finger – Global this is the most widely known, most widely used hand gesture. When somebody sticks up their middle finger at you, they're telling you to F off. If this is a global hand gesture, it means the same thing in just about every part of the world. You can use the middle finger to insult people no matter where you are. Subscribe for more!